Number 57. What is the focal length of a makeup mirror that produces a magnification of 1.5 when a person's face is 12 centimeters away? Explicitly show how you follow the steps in the problem solving strategy. Yeah, no, 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 no. I think you know by now what we're going to do. I think we're going to do it. So it tells us the magnification of the mirror, right? So M is going to be equal to 1.5. It also tells us the person's face is going to be 12 centimeters away. So that would be the distance of the object. The person's face is the object, right? It's 12 centimeters away. Just convert this to meter 0.12 meters. All right. And now what it's doing is it wants to find the focal length. All right, well, first of all, so we'll write F as a question mark. First of all, knowing the magnification and the uh, distance the object is, what I'm allowed to then do via this formula over here on the right-hand side is find the image distance, right? Negative DI over DO is equal to the magnification. To solve this for DI, simply cross multiply the DO on over and also bring the negative sign on over for the ride too, all right? So there's now our little formula. So now this tells us that the image distance is going to be equal to negative 1.5, that's the magnification, multiplied then by the uh, object distance of 0.12 meters. And this one you don't necessarily need to convert it into you know, meters, but you know, uh, whatevs. So negative 1.5 times 0.12, so this is negative 8, uh, 0.18, so negative 0 0.18 meters, okay? Now that is the image uh, distance. So now to find the focal length, if I know the image distance and I know the object distance, well, I can use now that thin lens equation. It's also the mirror equation. So DO, 1 over DO plus 1 over DI is equal to 1 over F. Solving this thing for F, well, basically all we got to do is just do a little bit of cross multiplication here, bring the F out of the denominator, and then this whole thing on into the denominator on that right-hand side. So clean it up a little bit. And this is just now one over that, all right? So this is now the focal length. See how nice and simple that algebra is, right? So this is then one over one divided by the object distance, which was 0 0.12, plus then one over now the image distance, which is negative 0 0.18. Plug that all into the calculator and it's do the denominator first, one divided by 0 0.12 minus basically one divided by 0.18 and then one divided by that value of 2.77, blah, blah, blah. And we get an answer here of 0 0.36 meters, all right? If you need that in centimeters, right, just move the decimal two places to the right, so it's 36 centimeters, but that's it, all right? So, aren't you glad you did it my way? We'll see you soon. Take care.